What's up, guys? Welcome back to the shop. So I got a thing. This thing is made by Talon Tools. It's called the Studmaster Easy Framing Speed Tool. This is the 16-inch version. They also make a 24-inch version. It's a jig to help you frame up walls. It's pretty cool. You can pick them up at TalonToolsUSA.com. I'll put a link for that down below. It is, uh, I think it's all cast aluminum, and it is made in the USA, which is nice. All right, so the concept of this is, you set this on the plate, and you line your studs in here, and it automatically puts you at 16 inch centers. So let's do a mock-up real quick. Pretend this is my top plate. That sets right on there. You'd slide one stud in. Slide another stud in. There you go. It's open at the end, so you can nail in, nail in. Then you would just move down. Thing looks like it could be pretty handy, so let's give it a try. Okay, unfortunately, when Talent Tool sent this to me, I was pretty much done with framing jobs for the foreseeable future. I told him I'd make a video about this, so we're gonna make do with what we've got. I made some room in the shop here. I've got a almost 12 foot plate, and luckily I'm a hoarder of firewood. So we're gonna use some of these cutoffs that I normally burn. We're gonna mock them up as studs. We're gonna give this thing a whirl and see how it works. All right, throw a few studs in here. Got the old pass load, and uh, let's get going. Put one right on the end. That goes there, that goes there. Slide the next one in. Everything looks pretty good. There you go, then you just jump down. Gun jams up at the most inopportune times. There it is. Not exactly sure what the time frame was on that. Plus I was kind of cheating because I wasn't using full size studs. Well, let's grab a tape measure, pull a tape on these and see exactly how accurate it is. Hook the end, 16, 32, 48, 64, 80, 96, 112, 128. Okay, so I do see one hiccup with this thing, and it's no fault of the tool because it's made for 16 on centers, but if you're laying out an exterior wall, uh, definitely more so exterior walls and interior walls, but an exterior wall and you want your sheathing to break at 48 inches, your first layout is actually at 15 and a quarter, not 16. So when you lay out at 15 and a quarter and you go quarters from there on out, you'll, you'll break at 48 inches. 
This doesn't give you that because it's 16, but if you were to lay your first one out at 15 and a quarter and nail it, that jig will run you the rest of the way out and all of your sheathing will break. So that's one thing to take into consideration if you're building exterior walls or interior walls that you need sheathing to break on 48 or 96, that you are gonna have to account for that three quarters of an inch on your first stud, but then after that, you'll be fine. All right, guys, there you have it. It's a handy little tool. Unfortunately, when they sent it to me, I didn't have any more framing jobs going on, so we made do with what we, we could here and you know mocked it up inside the shop. I think it worked out pretty well as a demonstration of how to use it. Um, I'll have to get it out on a job and see if it really helps anything. I've gotta say, I'm an old dog. It's gonna be tough to teach me a new trick, so I think I'm gonna stick with my staging plates and laying out. I work by myself, but if I were doing interior walls and I had a helper, I could give him plate measurements, he could cut them, and then he could just use this to run studs on them because interior walls usually don't have to worry about having that 48 or that 96 breaker for your plywood because you're just gonna run horizontal drywall usually. So in that case, could definitely be helpful. But like I said, I work by myself. But for any of you DIYers, homeowners out there who wanted to tackle something like building a shed or framing out your basement or something like that, you figure you could do it, which you can, this isn't rocket science. One of these would help if you're a little unsure of, of layouts. So I'd recommend it in, in uh, that aspect. And when Talon Tools sent this to me, they gave me a discount code for free shipping. So if you go to purchase one of these at talontoolsusa.com, use my code, my D-I-Y-A-D, M-Y-D-I-Y-A-D. They'll give you free shipping on one of these, so you really can't beat that. So I gotta say that's about it, guys. Drop down a comment. Let me know what you think about this thing. Go to talenttoolsusa.com, check them out. And uh, all the links to all that stuff will be down in the description. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Studmaster. Oh, 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 oh.